And when I get to the, the, the far right hand side, automation, um, there's obviously lots you can automate, but there's a big focus at the moment on how you can re-trigger and retrain your models automatically. So some, but not all applications are very lucky to have a natural feedback mechanism. If you're lucky enough to have the situation where your users are actually providing you with feedback, um, either in the form of new data or, or in the form of, you know, yes, that was a good result. Yes, that was a good prediction, something like that. You can use that information uh, to, to retrain your models and improve them over time. And you can then automate that process to make sure that uh, these new models are at least as good as the old models. And once you've got that feedback cycle in place, then you kind of don't need to touch it anymore until you need to make some large architectural changes to your model. Um, so I, I, I think that, you know, that's certainly optimal, but it's not, it's not the place where most companies are at the moment. Um, most companies are still, you know, either retraining manually or sort of retraining based upon a cron schedule, like once a day or something. Um, and that, that actually works. Okay. You know, I, uh, I, I haven't, I haven't come across a specific example where it's been, it's been, it's obvious that doing this continuously is, is really valuable, but I'm sure, I'm sure it is. So for, for the, for the people like, uh, the, you know, the Amazons of the world or the Googles of the world that are working with, with, with algorithms that are used, um, uh, to, uh, at, at such a scale, I, I, I could well believe that these are really important, but, well, um, for a smaller you, company. Yeah. Sorry. Go on. You describe as not doing it. Yeah. Why are they not doing it? Is it, it's not the lack of availability of tools um, or, or the, why, why are they not doing it? It's, it comes down to a value. It comes down like, how valuable is it? Like yeah. if we don't retrain that model every, yeah. so even, imagine just a simple cron schedule. If we don't retrain that model every day, then mm. you know, what, what's gonna happen? Like nothing, we're, we're gonna lose a little bit of performance. We might lose a tiny bit on the, on, on the uh, you know, some whatever metric you're measuring to, to kind of measure these things. Uh, but at the end of the day, we've got bigger problems elsewhere that are far more important than doing that. <laughs> but then also in those cases, and I totally agree with you, you know, just to do that by, um, because somehow it's a best practice, actually it might not be delivering that much value. In, yeah, exactly. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there might equally be cases where there's loads of value and right. it remains unidentified um and uh, and even if some person believes it can he articulate that to the organization surrounding it or something like that yeah yeah totally agree